Hey everyone and thank you for tuning in again on my channel. Today I'm making a video for you guys on how I pack for two for an infant and a toddler. If you're interested, just keep watching. So this video is a little different because I'm packing for my infant and for my two and a half year old and I want to show you guys how I like to pack for both of them. I try not to pack so many things. I used to be actually an overpacker. I used to carry so many bags with me and at the end of the day I regret it because most of the stuff that I bring with me they actually don't even use. I try to be as minimal as possible. As you guys know I absolutely love my Skip Hop Forma um, diaper backpack even though I've had it for a short while. Um, it has been so amazing you just want to be able to have hands free all the time we'll get started first with what's in this diaper bag we're going to the aquarium of the pacific tomorrow so i already checked out the weather and saw exactly what type of clothes i would need to bring first off i actually have this little makeup bag from ipsy that i subscribe to every month but i'm using it right now to put like um, my electronic essentials in here battery pack I should say and it's by <laughs> Jackery and this has um, come through a lot of times so I always make sure that this is fully charged before I throw it in my bag and then I have <laughs> the new iPhones headphones um, for my phone oh my god I can't even see Anyways, um, a little car charger in here, a wall charger, this little USB thing for the charger itself, and I just need to throw in um, USB lightning cable for my iPhone. So of course I have her formula, his diapers, and I'm actually using the cube that it came with. And I'm really happy with it because it compacts everything and it's easy to just um, put this in the bag. So I have two pairs of clothes here for her. This fits two pairs of pants and a long sleeve and a onesie for her. Of course my brick cloths. Socks. Her little teether. And then for Luke, I packed him a beanie. Chargers. In case if it starts getting cold over there the weather is like um, low 70s like 71 I don't know if it's gonna be windy or anything so I packed up my long sleeve a t-shirt extra pair of pants and some socks that's pretty much it as far as for their clothes I still have from my packing video like the diaper changer her bibs um, extra diapers for her. Pretty much the same stuff since my packing video. Now let's move on. So let's see what's in this giant red bag. I like to actually bring an extra bag. This is all the extra stuff like for snacks and other things that I know is not going to fit in my diaper bag and that I can actually just throw in the stroller. So first, I have this Skip Hop bottle bag. It's in the chevron print and I really like this because it has a stroller strap that you can just attach to the stroller. Put baby bottles in here, um, anything basically that you want to keep cool. It does come with that um, ice pack and I'll show you what it looks like on the inside. Then there is this little, I'll show you what this is. There's this mesh pocket right here. This is where you can keep the ice pack that it comes with and this is Luke's Contigo water bottle which I really like because it has this little button and the little spout just comes up and then you can just put it back down like this and it covers the spout so it keeps it nice and clean and it comes with a little handle and the straw and this is also spill proof so even if it's open like this and the water won't spill out. Next I have just have this large swaddle blanket so in case if she's sleeping in the stroller I could just kind of cover this over the canopy so the sun won't go through. 
And this, uh, my Dodgers <laughs> little, uh, what do you call this, drawstring backpack. And what I like to keep in here, show you guys. This is my Infantino baby carrier. I think this is called the Flip Advance, and I absolutely love this um, baby carrier compared to the high-end carriers I've had in the past. I actually prefer this more than my Baby Bjorn um, One carrier and also my Beko Soleil baby carrier. I actually really do prefer this and I kind of wish I, I purchased this first before um, the other carriers that I've had in the past because it's really lightweight and if you're like me, I'm short, I'm five feet and then the band that goes around the waist is not so thick, so it feels really nice on my waist. If you want a full review on this baby carrier, just comment below and I'll make another video um, on exactly more information about this baby carrier that I love so much. And what else I have? A sweater for her. This actually used to be Luke's sweater. It's a nine month old sweater for Lana. And I just purchased this, it's like a windbreaker jacket that I really like and I, I purchased this for Luke because I really like the print on it and you guys can guess why. He's in love with dinosaurs so and I bought this in a big size because he grows like a weed. So this one is um, actually size 5 for 5 year olds. And it fits him and it still gives him room to grow in it. So it's really lightweight and I didn't want to bring like a thick sweater, a thick jacket because my child, he doesn't get cold, he sweats a lot. So I got this at BB Gap. And then next I have snacks. So I have these two Ziploc baggies of snacks. I keep the dry snacks. What I have in this plastic baggie are these um... Mott's Medleys, like they're like little gummy snacks. The chewy peanut butter chocolate chip granola bars. I put a few in here. Not all for Luke, it's for mommy and daddy also. And then this pouch, um, I'm keeping this in the fridge until tomorrow so I can just pull it out. It has banana and some oranges also his juice and I already cut some apples for him so I'm just gonna throw this in the fridge so that way it's ready to go um, tomorrow and I really like keeping the snacks in the what do you call these zipper ziplock bags because then even if he eats a banana or orange I can just throw away the trash in here and then later on just toss it out and then also we just bought individual bags of chips and just a few water bottles so I will probably pack a few more things but that's basically mostly what I have packed for them so I hope you guys enjoyed this short packing video if you guys have any questions about any of the things that I showed you guys if you guys also have your own tips on how you pack for your kids um, just comment below and don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks. Bye